Hey everybody, welcome back to my Project 13. Thanks for coming on by and checking out this product review video. Appreciate your time and your support. Going to be doing a Soapy Guard skin install on my Samsung Galaxy S21 Ultra. Going to be installing the Honeycomb Gold for $9.99 over at the Soapy Guard website. I will be leaving a link down below in the description area. When you hit that link, it will send you directly to the Soapy Guard website where you can check out this exact skin that I'll be installing today and other skins with different styles and textures. Many, many to choose from. I will not be using a blow dryer today, but if you do, very important that you constantly move the heat around because, well, you can damage the skin, but more importantly, you can damage your smartphone. So, so it's very wise that if you want to heat up the adhesive so it adheres to the back of your S21 Ultra or any smartphone you're applying a skin to, constantly moving heat around and it doesn't need to be on high. It can be at about medium. But what you're doing is just, it, you're just heating up that adhesive so it sticks really, really uh, well to your smartphone that you are installing a skin on. So with that being said, let's go ahead and unpackage the skin. Thank you for your purchase. Please visit SobeGuard.com for installation guide. I'm definitely loving that presentation. So let's go ahead and take the contents out. Army Combat Green camera skin there. I asked Soapy Guard if they would include that, and they did. Here is the honeycomb gold skin. Very nice, beautiful looking skin. Got the micro cloth here with the brand name Soapy Guard. Love the logo. And here we have the alcohol prep pad to clean the back of my S21 Ultra. All right, let's go ahead and do this. Gonna speed up the video a little bit so you can listen to some music and then we'll do a final look. It does help if you have something like a little rubbery mat that's going to have some stick that you can lay on a flat surface and then lay your smartphone down that you are installing a skin on. It just helps keep it in place a little bit here. And I got this little sticky rubbery mat, some screen protectors that I ordered in. I can't remember what smartphone it was, but it really, really helps during the installation process. And uh, I'm totally digging the look. It's a little different than what I typically do honeycomb gold skin and we got that army combat green there and that just looks really good it, and i feel good about the protection my camera area is going to get since i had to remove the glass camera protector and i can put a link for that product down below in the description area along with the soapy guard link and i got a couple cases over here from uag the plasma and the lucent case both semi-clear. You're going to get a little more clear with the Lucent case, but that way you can, uh, or I can see my beautiful skin here and uh, whatever you bring in. I, you know, if you want to show it off, it's probably best to use a, a clear type of case, at least where it's almost clear. With here, we have this pattern going on here with this uh, Lucent clear case got this nice texture on the inside with this pattern and uh, the reason I didn't use a blow dryer is because I'm going to have a case on uh, to protect my investment and the case pretty much uh, presses down on the skin got a little couple of air bubbles there and that that pressure from the case is going to help it adhere to the back of my S21 Ultra what do you think let me know down below 
in the comment section, man, but I think it's looking really, really nice. It just gives it a different look. And if we take this one off, let's get the uh, plasma series case over here. You can see that looks really, really nice as well. Wow. That's gorgeous. Links for these cases as well down below in the comment section. And with that, again, another huge shout out to Soapy Guard. And uh, that's it, man. Stay tuned for more videos coming your way soon. Peace, God bless, stay safe and healthy. I'm out.